it was great. And uh, God rest his soul, man. We 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 spent a lot of time together on the on the practice floor, individual workouts, watching film, watching clips. Um, and <laughs> if I can go back and forth with him and have him disagree with me and then double back and tell me I was right and we all know how stubborn he was man it's just it 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 just gave me a, a wealth of confidence man in myself as a coach and you know just seeing him and him sharing with me the different ways he saw the game but just and even with Russ, LeBron, AD, all these guys, Giannis, Chris Middleton, Drew Holiday, all these guys I've been, Al Horford, Paul Millsap, these guys I've been able to coach and be around and learn from them. It's a two-way street. It's not just this coach that thinks he knows it all and he's just barking orders. No, you have to be able to, again, to collaborate, communicate, and understand each other. And, and, and not your way or my way, but what's the best way to go forward? What's the best plan for all of us? So... Kobe was right, you know, at the forefront of that in my own development as a coach. You know, just the workouts we would do on the court, the type of film we would watch, um, dinners we, we've had just off offline, just getting away from it all. Like, you know, he's a big part of why I was able to grow the way I did as a coach.